We don't need no stinking phone calls. We got work to do. We got an email. We want two electric vehicles to film this amazing series long way up. We want you to be a part of it. What are we up to? Uh, 6,600, there we go. So yeah, and we've got about that to go again. Uh, it's gonna be still quite the adventure. I can't really predict exactly what we're gonna face because that is the great unknown. This incredible journey from South America up to LA. I am so excited that they have license plate and they are on public roads. It's win number one, the first car, which is truly registered for Rivian. We built this vehicle to get some early durability testing. It looks and feels somewhat like production, but is very early and somewhat prototyping. When you give it full throttle, it is like four seconds to 80. In the production vehicle, we'll have more power and more torque to go even faster. 100 days of driving, 13 countries, 13,000 miles, wide open spaces. There are a bunch of wild horses. We just pulled up next to them, and it's a completely silent vehicle just sitting there idling. But there's no idle because you're an electric vehicle. One of the biggest challenges is charging. We built out a charging network throughout this route of South and Central America so that you can do this. We're really happy to be showing people that you can have an adventure in some of the most remote places imaginable. Wow. This place is amazing. The testing is going really well. We're getting lots of data to understand what's happening, specifically with the battery, suspension, and chassis components. How can we get the car to act and react better. We've taken all of that data, we put it into the vehicles that we're going to have out to customers next year. I mean, we're all familiar with a lot of electric vehicles on the road today, but there is nothing sort of doing what this vehicle is embarking on right now. We've got sand, we've got rock, these washboard roads, constant go, 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 for, you know, 90 plus miles. It's all going to create a better product at the end of the day because this is a pretty epic adventure and if they can get through this, I think they'll get through pretty much anything. <laughs> I don't know, the fact that we're out here getting to do this and show the vehicles are capable, um, it's a pretty sweet day at the office. Thank you for being out here for us. <laughs> Thanks for having us, man.